This house has been here for the past 40 years and this is a 318 rooms 5 star hotel but it never had any guests and right now we are going to go inside a 318 rooms 5 star hotel that has been abandoned for the past 40 years and let's see what we are going to find when we get inside the rooms. This is really 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 dark. Do not hunt what you cannot kill. The drawings keep getting better and better. What is the meaning of this? Yes. It means you must stay here. You must stay here. Yeah. I don't know who is telling us we are going to stay here, but I'm sure we are not going to stay here, my brother. Anywhere you are, we will go and come back. And this one here says Tan Ubanka. And if we translate it to English, it means your father. So guys, take a look at this massive structure behind me. I was exploring the city of Jos and I saw this structure right here. This is an abandoned house. Currently, this, I think it's an abandoned hotel. And this hotel has been abandoned for over 40 years here in the city of Jos. This reminds me of a hotel I filmed in Abia State that I titled The Hotel That Never Had a Guest. But this one is way bigger. This one is more massive. And this structure just look like the Sheraton Hotel in Abuja. Just take a look at that structure. So, this place has been abandoned. Remember, when I went to the abandoned hotel in Abia State, people that was there, that was living close to that hotel, told me that I shouldn't enter. There is a lot of bad activities happening inside the hotel. I went here with Basrola, I went here with Basrola. All our government has, the government has, and the government has, and the government has, and some kind of parts in the Malikopo, some attitudes, some... Is the government worth it? And then they went 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 but I want to, I want to see if we can go inside here. And if we go inside, if we are able to go inside, I will bring you guys and show you what we are going to find inside this massive building right here. But take a look at that building. That building is so massive. So that is what we are going to do right now. But first of all, let's get close to. If if I get close, then and I feel like I can go inside, we can go. But if I don't feel like I can go inside, then there is definitely no reason for me to go. But Currently, I'm not scared of anything. I'm willing to enter. Hopefully, there is nothing there. But let's go and find out what we can see first. But I'm not going alone. I have uh, my brother here, Simon Arome. He's also a YouTuber. And we are going to go inside here. He lives in this city. But let me ask you some questions before we go. Yeah. Uh, this hotel, do you know anything about the hotel? Okay, the least I know is, the first thing I know about is it's abandoned. Okay. And it's been here for ages. I don't know how long. I think over 40 years. Okay. Yeah. And it's very creepy. Most people just passed here and they don't know what the hotel okay. holds. So we want to explore it and check it out and what it has. Are you scared? Truly, yes. I am very, very scared. Uh, what are the things you're scared of? Because me, currently, I'm not scared. I don't know. And if you're scared, it might break down my own morale. <laughs> what are the things you're scared of? Please let me know I'm because you are of, in this city. I know it's dark and I'm scared of snakes. Snakes. True? I'm scared of snakes and Do you all. think do you think we can see snake here? Yeah? Probably we might. So let's we we'll just be careful. That's why we're wearing shoes. <laughs> okay. Yeah. If, let me tell you something. This is a very massive house here and uh, snake is not my own problem. If snake is the only issue then I don't have any problem, but let's go and see. If we can go inside, then we will go inside and see what we can find. But if we cannot then we will end the video. The main reason why we are going into this building today is to get to the top of the hotel and when we get there we want to check out the whole environment and maybe we can find out why this hotel is built at this point and we also want to know why this hotel was abandoned for the past 40 years. Just take a look at the view. You get here. 
I feel like the reason why this hotel was built is to give the is to give the people the view of this Lamingo Dam. Exactly. And I think exactly. at the back that side is the Sherry Hills. Hills. Yes. Wow. As we got to the second level, we started to see some interesting drawings followed by creepy writings on the wall. We can't really tell who are the people writing these things or the motive behind the writings, but here are some of the most interesting drawings and writings we saw on the wall. So, as we get up, the drawings keep getting better and better. What is the meaning of this? Yes. It means you must stay here. You must stay here. Yeah. Saman Duli. Like, like Duli means um, a must. Must. Saman, like, stay here. Must. You must stay here. Imagine, as we are going up, the view and the drawings are getting more interesting. They said we must stay here. Then there is uh -huh. a danger sign. And there is a danger sign. We must stay it's here. Cold. Do you think people are outside here? For this artwork to be here, that's me. Either people who are visited here or people still stay here. Uh, there is somebody that wrote that thing. Somebody drew this thing. Because this thing did not just come up on the wall. So somebody drew this thing. So there are probably some people inside here. And uh, who are the people that are telling us that we must stay here? <laughs> I don't know who is telling us we are going to stay here. But I'm sure we are not going to stay here, my brother. Anywhere you are. We will go and come back. <laughs> we must go and come back. The one you are telling us we must stay here. Are you scared, my brother? <laughs> this is really scary. For for real, do like no jokes. Uh, this is in Hausa, actually. That's Hausa, right? Yeah, that's Hausa. Zamandule. Yeah. You must stay here. As we got to the second level, this is what greeted us here. You see somebody showing you five hands, and in this language, this actually means your father. So somebody is telling us your father. And this is danger zone keep off but i'm not seeing any danger yet except uh a very dark long walkway this danger and everything they wrote here we don't know yet where we are going to find them but let's go there is a lot of creepy writings at every entrance of this building so let's just ignore them and enter the building let's see what we are going to find inside the building we have seen some of the things that was in the outside but let's go and see the inside right now but, but i noticed something take a look at you will notice that there was a structure here there was you see Notice that something was built across this place before and I think those are the blocks that were scattered here, right? Yes. I think so. I think these blocks that are scattered here, okay, take a look at this. It's people that deliberately broke down these blocks and I don't think it's the government that did that. It's people that broke this thing. Yeah, because actually this place is government owned. Yes. But right now it doesn't seem as if it's run by the government. Yes. Because you can see what is written on the wall, especially. I, what I, what you can notice here is there is activity going on here, and I'm not sure this activity is, is done by the government. This one is just destroying the blocks, maybe to make it an easy way for escape. I swear to God, there is a sound here. But, 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 no, no, no joke, jokes apart. I heard a sound. Did you hear the sound? That was why I turned. <laughs> if you see the, <laughs> if you see the why I turned. Okay, I think it's from this bag. Wait, 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 calm down. Calm down. I think it's from this thing. Yeah, I think it's from the other one. I think it's from I think it's from here. I hope so. Yeah. I think it's from this thing. But wait, there is interesting writing I saw here. Wait. Don't hunt what you cannot kill by Jackson. Do not hunt what you cannot kill. And then somebody is saying here, I don't know if you understand what this is. What? 
Don't hunt what you cannot kill. This thing is getting more creepy now. It's getting very creepy around here. And the thing is... Take a look at that. Take a look at that. This is, this is such a water. Seems like somebody was here. This one was, I think somebody kept this thing here. No, I just saw it now, that's why I came here. I think somebody is here. Somebody is around. This looks very recent. Yes, just like somebody dropped it now. And you can see it here. And it says here, Dog Mansion. It's getting more creepy, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Can we just hasten up and leave this? Yes, place? let's try our best and do. Yeah. Okay, this is where we are going to show you. are more right up here. Ooh. So far, how are you feeling? <laughs> I don't know if I'm the person making you do this, but how are you feeling so far? The place, see where we came out, we just came out here to rest more because so far things we are seeing has been so creepy how are you feeling so far you know the first time you reached out to me and told me about we coming back here yes it's like a trauma <laughs> because i remember the last time i came here it was like a nightmare so me coming back here is bringing back like ptsd okay. i'm trying to remember everything that happened here this feels so quiet and calm i could imagine if this hotel hotel was actually functioning how how beautiful it will look you can yes. look at the rock formation and everything here yes this this thing was built in a place where nothing would actually disturb it like only the hotel and the view what you get here is the hotel the view, view the water the water the view of the city you can see this is city this way yes this side you can look at the city of jaws and look at the rocks look at the mountains surrounding it and this place you can see all these rocks and the other side you can see the lamingo dam this is actually a very interesting place to build a five-star hotel but the question is why is it abandoned that is one of the reasons why we are inside this building today but after a lot of research about this hotel the only information i could get on the internet is that the name of this hotel is the joss rock hotel this is a hotel that was expected to have 318 rooms and this hotel was commissioned in 1981. This is a 5 star hotel that comes with a helipad. I will put the list of other things that this hotel was supposed to offer in front of the screen. So the big question is why is it abandoned? I did a lot of research to find out why this hotel was abandoned but I couldn't find any tangible reason why the hotel was abandoned. But the good news is I read an article from two years ago that says the government of Plateau State is willing to to sell this project to any private investor that is interested in buying the project so if you are a private investor and you want to buy this hotel and develop it to the highest level this is your opportunity to go and try but do not forget the article i'm talking about is from two years ago but if you find interest in this project you want to invest or you want to buy the project you can go straight to the plateau state government and contact them to find out what what i saw here is three elevators three elevator space this one this one and this one so if this thing was completed actually there will be three elevators here that is actually very massive yes it is very massive and for uh, for a hotel that was supposed to have for a hotel that have 318 rooms yes i think three elevators is very very good sorry to say but one thing we have one of our major problem is once the government starts something, means once another government comes in, they fail to continue. Yes, they will just drop all those things and start talking about their own. Their own. Why not do the one that is already on ground? Mm. So that is it for the abandoned hotel in Jos, the capital of Plateau State in Middle Belt, Nigeria. And while we were inside the hotel, what we were able to see is some creepy writings on the wall and uh, 
a very lonely place i thought in the first place we are going to see other things like maybe people or snakes but at the end of the day we didn't find anybody but we saw some creepy writings on the wall which shows that people actually comes there there are a lot of things we saw there that shows that people actually comes there imagine the amount of revenue this place could have been generating for the city but at the end of the day this is what it is go and check simon arome go and check him out and uh, subscribe to his channel he's actually doing a lot of travel content both in jaws and in the whole nigeria so not just um, nigeria just not um, just also i create videos around the world so, so um, i hope to show you guys african content so the aim is to promote africa to the world and show african stories oh. of the world so that they will know about us and our real heritage right okay yeah. so guys you have heard it from the horse's mouth that is how they say it <laughs> yeah. go right now and subscribe to his channel if you did enjoy what you watched if you did enjoy the travel videos that i create for you you will definitely enjoy his content so go right now the the name of his uh, youtube channel is on the screen and the link to the channel is in the description so go now and subscribe to the channel thank you so much for watching and bye for now